In that new report, the state says Boston Public Schools needs to make immediate improvements, saying the district is failing to serve the students who need them most. In the nearly 200 page report, the Massachusetts Department of Elementary and Secondary Education says, quote, the district has failed to effectively serve its most vulnerable students, carry out basic operational functions and address systemic barriers to providing an equitable quality education. The report says Boston Public Schools fails to help its most vulnerable students, lacks urgency in improving special education, fails to provide quality resources for English learners and to help its lowest performing schools. When it comes to transportation, the report found in January alone, more than a thousand bus routes went uncovered, leaving 16,000 students without rides. BPS pushed back, saying it's working to address the bus driver shortage. While the state did highlight some successes, it warns frequent leadership turnover could mean that progress is lost. The district superintendent is leaving at the end of the school year. Her replacement marks the fifth new superintendent within 10 years, according to the state. The state saying, quote, the district remains without stable leadership or strong institutional knowledge to tackle the critical and persistent challenges facing BPS. Now, in separate statements, both Mayor Michelle Wu and the district say they both look forward to working with the state on making those improvements. The district says it plans to talk about that report at Wednesday's school committee meeting. Reporting live, Emily Maha, WCVB News Center 5.